Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Rahim. Alhamdulillah Rabbil Alamin Hasban Allahu wa Nima Wakil. The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? And yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil, my cup run it over, and surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. And I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Assalamu alaikum. It's Monday. Welcome to Johnny's Bite. Well, the weekend was good. And uh, lots and lots of conversations happened. But over the weekend, I took another read at Professor Kwabena Frimpong Boateng's report to the president after he had closed his work or finished his work on the Interministerial Committee on Galamse, right? Interministerial Committee on Illegal Mining. You remember that in that, in that, in that report, he had mentioned a lot of names, so many big wigs, and the office of the special prosecutor or the special prosecutor has assured us that once yeah, you know your name comes up, you will be you'll be invited or investigated, whatever it is. So we are waiting and watching that the names that have been mentioned, even from the presidency, will be dealt with. One of the things that struck me was one of the callers that I had last week. And said that, look, there's been a pathologist in the Ashanti region who had told a sister station that um, children are now being born with a lot of mutations because of illegal mining or galamse, because of the chemicals they are drinking. I spoke with an environmentalist, the fish we eat and all of that, how the chemicals are in there, how the dangerous metals and everything is, is in there. And one, one of my callers last week asked why the chief of staff is quiet. Because if children are being born with a lot of mutations, no ear, sometimes one eye, leg missing, all of those ones, it's a pathologist that said that. Children are being born with mutations. The chief of staff is a woman, first of all. Somebody from her office by the name of Protozo has been mentioned in that report. The chief of staff has not spoken about it. But just last Friday, the chief of staff was telling us to go and support green garden and plant trees. Maybe the chief of staff has forgotten that by doing galamse, you actually cut down trees. The same trees that we are spending money to plant. There are trees that we came to see. This morning I had uh, Cocoa Board also talking about the fact that if your cocoa farm is within a forest, a, a, a forest area, you don't qualify and all of that. I find that ridiculous. In the past, where were the cocoa farms? Johnny's bite. What is a forest, by the way? In the past, where were the cocoa farms? Who cut the trees? We complain about Sada and Jida. We even made mockery and said our confirm had flown out of the country. Today, we are planting trees and cutting trees in all the 47 forest reserves. Johnny's bite. Shouldn't we be bowing down our heads in shame? And she didn't the chief of staff as a woman, a mother figure in society, a supervisor of all the ministries that were put together as the IMCIM. Shouldn't she be speaking for the women who have no voice of their own? Play me that video when Captain Smart and his team went to Obwasi. When some, some stooges tried to chase them out of the place. Right? Play the video. Listen to, listen to it. This is a hotel they slept in. Play the video. Johnny's fight. And I'm so you know, Obuasi, and we even in your gallery. Hey, you know, you're you you this was what Captain Smart and his team saw in Obasi. And there's another video by Yatiti, but we don't have too much time. So the extent of Galamse, this is it. This is why the youth in Obasi did not allow that, that guy. And he had come to the place suggesting that he belonged to a certain tax force set up by the MCE for the area and all of that. How we embolden 
criminals to, to, to visit mayhem on us as a people is still shocking to me. We are emboldening criminals. And I, I'm, I'm putting in a test to the chief of staff. Auntie Freeman, somebody in your office has been mentioned in the Frimpo Boati report. This is water the people of Oba. Show the video. This is water the people of Obuasi are drinking. Water they are bathing with. We went there as visitors, and this is what we saw. And we are bringing a report to you. Children are being born with mutations. As a mother figure, what do you say? You have not spoken. So that is why I will take what you are saying, that everybody must support the planting of trees. I take it with a pinch of salt. And that's my issue with the tree planting thing. I'm not against planting trees. I love greens. I love planting of trees any and everywhere, grass. and ev I love it. But if the same people who are cutting down the trees and enabling people to cut down the trees and destroy our environment because of their greed and wickedness are the same people coming to us and telling us to go and plant trees, you have to look at them well. 